Hey, Yama, you mob. Yama. I wanted to tell you, uh, Gilan Bogon. Story about Bogon. Uh, it shouldn't be far off coming into our nation down here, though. This mob got a sometimes barrena barrena. They got to fly, you know, over a thousand kilometres to get down into our nation you know, in Radri. Uh, yeah, Bogon is one of the words we use for the fellas. Another mob called Bogon. And sometimes they, in a place called Queensland or up that place up there, they start off where their, their mums and dads have laid the eggs and they turn into little caterpillars. Some, I think some mob call them cutworms, I think. They have a feed up and then when they're able to burn up, they head down this way for the warmer season and have a big feed up and get up nice and big so they can so store some some energy and then have a sleep down here for a while and then when it's time to head back they have their boobages they lay their eggs they head back another thousand kilometres again Don't global isn't it anyway our mob use them as a food source for thousands of years and then obviously too they um a lot of little uh, barley gun animals use them to have a bit of a feed on too but anyway bullgone shouldn't be far off coming through keep an eye out tells us seasons changing and uh, I believe they're on the endangered list of animals now, so we need to look after them, eh? Anyway, Bogon, Gilan, Bogon story. Hey, hope you learned something today. Good way, you, and I always forget to do something, don't I? Oh, yeah. Uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Tussle. Ta.